Oh shit, it's rainy. What's on my quesadillas? And get your kiss on. Today I was gonna see Sora. We're gonna drink and we're gonna have some fun at our friend Steven's house because he's leaving. He's going back to Boston. You might remember Steven from a long time ago, a while ago, but yeah, he's he's going back now. He's going back now to Boston, so it's kind of sad. What? Yo. It's Yo, and it's been a year. I haven't seen this guy for so long. I know, man. He left like like at the beginning of the pandemic, and now it's like I don't know what part of what <laughs> part we're in, but I think yeah, is it the end or the middle nah, or the? I don't think it's, it's the, the end. it's probably the beginning. So. Yeah, it's still the, now case back. But that was was quarantine. Extra safe with it for like a month. Yeah. Now yeah. he's out here in the. Oh shit! I got to put on a mask. My mom told me to. That's the only way I could come here. That was the circumstance. Yeah, so I don't know if you guys remember Steven's face right here. I met him at the at, a, at the meetup when I first came to Japan. And he was kind of like me and Sora's mentor, like in the very, in the beginning, in our- The tour guide. In the early days of Japan. <laughs> so he's finally leaving. Master Steven's leaving. So yeah, we're just gonna have some fun today. Holy shit, yo, Steven has such a nice share house. It's way better than the one I live. Get some good shots. <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> Emma's cooking up some diarrhea looking substance. Oh, we're about to have a nice dinner. I feel like an adult. We're at the age where we're making home cooked meals. Having a good, good, nice moment. Like this group of friends right here, we would just like meet up every once in a while. Let's do a prayer. Prayer, okay. Okay. Wish him success for the future and make sure he doesn't get ripped off by his blood. Uh, hopefully, he finds some nice weed and some nice women, and <laughs> hopefully, his family and everyone else's family stay safe during this quarantine. And I'm hungry as fuck, so come on, let's wrap this up. Amen. 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 Gang shit, y'all. Yo. Let's go. Yo, yeah, shit, I should be a priest. Oh, now she's talking about the broccoli. Yo, hell. What the hell, guys? And no one else got broccoli. Y'all are hugging the <laughs> yo, I have a chill, yo, we're all hungry. Yeah, like, Dr. Ash. She's the chef. Yeah. Yo, I went in that kitchen, yo. Fucking Emma, gross. I saw you on your phone. I saw Steven doing all the way. Yeah, what? You can just shut the fuck up. Fuck this guy. <laughs> yeah, you don't have any allergies, right? No. Okay, cool. Whatever. Okay, it's good. Alright, I'm gonna do more quinoa. Yeah, well, you guys are figuring it out. Alright. Yeah. 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 Alright, Steven. I got you a present. You got me a present? Yes. What's going on, bro? Alright. Here we go. What? Look at this. Aw, oh, it probably has hepatitis. Aw, oh, it's so cute, dude. Thanks, man. This is so cute, man. It's from the zoo. The zoo? Yeah. Tokyo Zoo. Oh, shit. Yeah, so. Thank you, my sister, for giving me that.
gotta do, I'll take your girlfriend and put that pussy on the pedestal. This is your vibe. This is your vibe. That's something I think about. But I mean, like, not. But if it happens, like, if you get someone pregnant, like, and you get someone pregnant. Yeah, yeah. that's what I'm saying, bro. Have you had, have you had, like, those kind of scares before? Yeah. You remember the Malaysian chick? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, who was that? Lena? Lena? Oh, you have cute kids, though. That's pretty cute. Yeah, but I won't be in the picture. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding, maybe. I always, like, work on for, like, I know for a fact, like, I'm not trying to catch anything. And I'm, I mean, like, I knew she was safe, but. Like out of nowhere, like I get a text, right? I'm just chilling at my house, and she's like, it's like, oh, like I think I'm late, like, like my life, like, flash, like, <laughs> dude. <laughs> dude, and I was like, oh my god, and then like the next day, she's like, oh, never mind, oh my god, okay. and I was like, holy shit, that's crazy, and that's when it came to my mind, like, oh fuck, what do you think about birth control? Thank God, God for birth control. No, thank God, God for birth control. And, and abortion, Steven? <laughs> no, not, uh, I'm not for abortion, though. Really? Yeah. I mean, like, I think, like, if that's a decision they want to make, yeah, like, yeah. sure, you know, I can respect that, but, like, I wouldn't want to. Yeah. yeah. So, like, if you do get a girl by, by accident, like, that's it. I mean, it's her, it's her choice. Oh, yeah. You know, it's her body, right? She has to go through it. Yeah. But I would try to, like, talk about it. You know? What about you? This man used to be, this man used to be a raw dog, 24/7. For real, bro. <laughs> bro yeah, dog, dude, I'm still surprised. Like this man is not like, you know, does this have a little K running around? <laughs> he probably, <laughs> probably does. There probably is a little dude out there. Yeah. Where's my dad? <laughs> he, he's just at the store, honey. He's, he's getting cigarettes. He's at the 7-Eleven. <laughs> How do you guys feel about cameras? Like, what kind of camera? Like, when you're on camera. Like right now? Yeah. <laughs> I'm fine. I like being behind the camera more. Same. Like, same. You're like both. Yeah, I'm both. Because you film yourself. Yeah. Which is like, you know, like both worlds. Yeah. Really cool. <laughs> but you got used to it though. Like, when you were first starting out, did you feel comfortable? Like, in front of a camera? Um. It was just, uh, it was like a lot more rehearsed. Like if I uploaded the unedited footage, it would just be me feeling. Hey guys. Hey guys. <laughs> hey guys. <laughs> now it's like maybe two takes. Or, yeah, yeah. I remember like watching your old videos. There would be a lot of cuts. Yeah. And now it's just like well, continuous. Yeah, no, now I mean I use a lot of cuts now, but yeah. it's just the spaces in between. It's not like we say something over and over. Yeah. Yeah. I think you have good timing, like for your transitions. Yeah. It's almost comedic sometimes. Mm -hmm. yeah. 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 I think that's what you should stop and strive for, right? Yeah. That's yeah. What I don't think anyone really sees it, but like everything in my video, like every part of it has meaning. Like it's like two hours of footage and then I cut it down to like 10 minutes. That means like every part is literally something I chose to that to be in the video. It's not just like a it's not just shit. So if you have that, if you know that, then I feel like you can notice all the little nuances in my videos and stuff like that. Like things like background noise, like you'll, you'll notice like, like two kids arguing or something. Yeah. You'll notice like, like, 
I want to go through a divorce on her phone or something. I <laughs> just noticed shit. I think my favorite video is, I think it was like 10 things you like about Japan or like 18 things you like about Japan. I forgot the video. But no, it's that like, was probably a fraud in Japan. <laughs> no, no, that was you. No, like you were talking about like, like the things you enjoy about Japan. I don't know, you're just making like mad background noises. <laughs> I don't know, it was so funny though. Well, I don't remember. If I have to choose a favorite, you, I think you would know. Oh, of course. Which one? Ultra. Yeah, Ultra. dude, that show was so like... I saw that. I, I, finally, like, I finally, well, I never watched it before, but I watched it like maybe two months ago. Mm -hmm. and I'm like, damn, you guys fucking... Dude, like... Had a good ass time. I don't know, it kind of it kind of looked like, like a movie, like kind of like a Project X type of like, there's a mission to be had, and the mission is to like go into this festival. Right. Yeah, that's that was free, fun. and like we had the build up to it with scouting the night before, and then like the execution day, and then like the afterwards. It's like, like I don't know what it is, but just being around like all these people like enjoying one thing and like all just like I don't know, like smiling. Like yeah. it's so rare in Japan, and dude, it felt like so good and like liberating. Like I'm like, oh, oh like, the people there. Yeah, like yeah. even though they weren't going like crazy like in America, like where there's like you know headbanging and like going yeah. crazy, they were just like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But like still, like you could just tell they're enjoying their like self. It was just an essential moment for my like, trip in Japan. I mean, like, that was a good moment. Like, like I don't think I'll ever forget that. That shit was so fucking. Eighteen fun. living in Japan. That's so fun. Oh. That's it. Yeah. Am I in that one? You're in that. You're in the thumbnail. Yeah. I remember Kay would be like, "Oh, hey, I'm gonna put you in the thumbnail. I think I got more clicks." <laughs> I, was like, I was like, "Dude, go ahead." And I remember. I remember we went to Shin. Is that the Shinokubo like, video? Oh, ah! So the <laughs> what do I say? <laughs> oh shit, everyone's running, I gotta go. The train's gonna end soon. Okay. The Japanese convenience stores, there's some real good shit. And uh, there's also <laughs> some real good shit right here. The You're showing the magazine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a lit. Oh, so they want to go play Mario Kart. Oh, well, yeah, dude. <laughs> You got, a picture, you got a video of me peeing. Oh wait, I just died! Game over. You died, game over. Do you ever rewatch your old videos, dude? Well, if you want no. to hear yeah. your full fingers. Sometimes. I'm not gonna explain that, it's just a lot of things, but I moved out. I'm in my uncle's house now. My uncle's pretty chill. And we got you town with this. <laughs> She bit your she bit your finger. Alright, 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 so alright, so alright, so It's like should I use all this? Alright. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> it looks like going on right there, got the tissue box, you know, for the for those boogers. You got a mirror here too. I've never had a mirror. I have to have a dumbbell by the door because then you each channel will open it. I'll show you, watch. Yui chan! <laughs> so cute, hey. dude. For real. What's up? Oh, 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 he's trying my hand. Let's do an apartment tour. Come on, let's go. So, first of all, we got December 2018. So, that was two Damn. years ago, for sure. Yeah. I, ha I have the Snapchat memory of November 2018, and I think we're all at B Cafe. Yeah, I got some videos from back then. Yeah, I got right. the video you guys passed out in the karaoke booth right. on your birthday. Emma was there, and ah, I was, right. I was, you know, making out, and I like accidentally put it on my story. Oh yeah, yeah. dude, I remember. <laughs> I woke up and I was like, "Fuck!" <laughs> yeah, this guy was so close to in there. You're like, <laughs> just straight slurping. Oh man. Yeah, a lot of memories from fucking two years, man. Yeah, bro. Yeah. So many. What's the difference from then and now? I have more money? Shit. <laughs> Alright. I feel like we went through like the glamour phase of Japan. Like, I don't know, for me, like, I went, I went from like being maybe like a weeb and I wasn't a weeb, but like, like kind of that weeb mentality of like Japan's this divine, amazing, perfect sanctuary. Mm -hmm. But now you kind of get the, like we were talking about before, like you kind of Actually, start to realize the reality. Like the. The kind of like magic has worn away, right? Yeah. Like whenever I go somewhere, I'm like yeah, whatever. Yeah. 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 Whereas before, I'd be like wow, check that out. Yo, what the hell? They have a donkey over there. Yeah. Now I'm just like oh, whatever. <laughs> yeah, that is true. Yeah. Now I'm gonna get excited to see Dunkin' Donuts. Yeah. yeah. Wow, dude. Dunkin' Donuts. America runs on Munchkins. Fuck, I'm gonna oh, get Munchkins. diabetes from yeah. fucking. Yeah. Hey, they have a Pan Express now. Oh, here. I don't shoot. We, we we've oh, never yeah. seen that part though. 
Oh, really? I don't think so. Yeah, he hasn't gone to the National like Park yet. Parko? No, nah, so dude, it's park. like like I've never seen it, right? Hmm. And like when I when I was looking for it, I was like, "What? It's here!" And it's like crazy. Hmm. They got a, a skate park on the rooftop. It was like a park on the rooftop, and then they got a skate park. They got a volleyball court. They got rock climbing walls. Everybody goes in. That's like the place to be. Yeah, like all the high school kids there. Right? Yeah, all the high school kids are there. out there trying to get some of the cafeteria. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, it's the next day. We had a good time. He was going back to Boston. Going back to Boston. That day. Is there anything you wanna talk about? Like before you leave? Tell the case of these. Japan's not what you think it is. <laughs> Let's put it that way. Japan is an awesome country, but it's not all about anime, it's not all about, you know, clubbing. It's its own country, just like any other country, and there's good and bad sides to it. You know, and after living here for three years, you know, I feel like I've gotten to see most of those sides, right? You know? mm. Yeah, I would say. So you feel pretty done with it? You know, I'll always love Japan, mm. um, but I don't think it's where I belong. You know? I feel that. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely, after Corona, you kind of realize, like, spending time with your friends and your family, like, that's so valuable, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. And you're lucky that you came with your parents and family this time you know yeah. that's true Food. I think Japan is just like honestly magical like there's something going on every day at every moment right it is, it you is. turn a corner bam here's a unknown spot like mm -hmm. we just found like a really great bar the other day you know that we've never been to but we've always passed by that yeah, area right. 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 on their path and yeah and they they have like great music taste you know and it's such a chill but there's endless things to discover here yeah yeah, you know? yeah. yeah. but I guess at some point you get tired of exploring and you want just like you know, consistency, I guess, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, you're lucky you got to have your break. You know, I haven't had a break from Japan in three years. Yes, yeah, so I'm, I'm ready to, I'm ready for this again. Yeah. I'm excited yeah. again. You gotta brace yourself. Round two. Yeah, round fucking three, four. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. Enough, but. Living in Japan was always my dream, you know, as a kid. And then I finally go ahead and do it. And it's like, okay, what now? you know what's my next dream and now like as i gotten older and spent time here like i've developed new dreams right mm -hmm. and yeah, those dreams are not here now now i gotta go back and sometimes you gotta leave home to realize like where you want to be mm -hmm. you know mm -hmm. and that's home <laughs> that's home mm -hmm. yeah that is a big factor like i'm sure you miss miami to heck yeah yeah and i can't even imagine how much has changed since you left oh dude it's crazy it's probably underwater by now yeah exactly right aside from that I just you know, I'm thankful that I met you guys. You know, I'm thankful that we had a a blast. You know, it's like having brothers. You know, having having little brothers over here. You know. Yeah, it's a good time. Yeah. A lot of good times. Yeah, yeah. they literally. Yeah, we all grew together, right? For these, for this, like, I don't know. It's like we're all leaving from. We're all we all left home. Mm. We all like put up a new challenge, and we all like basically like did our challenge like. Together, yeah, bro. We only had each other when we first came here. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. I know. Me and Sora were talking about it. It's like funny how uh, we met up. You know, I met Sora the day before my meet up. Meet up. I met you, Emma, and then after that, we just like we hung out quite a lot, like in the beginning. But then, like after that, we would just have like a reunion, like every couple months. Yeah, that's true. That's basically what it yeah. was. But things always change, man. That's like that's what I always say, man. The only constant in life is change, and you just gotta enjoy things for what they are. Because of course, I could be like, oh man, I wish we could still do that. You know, hang out every other yeah. day mm -hmm. and do all that stuff. Yeah. But like, nah, like things change. We meet new yeah. people. Mm -hmm. We got other priorities. I'll be broke if I kept doing that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I'll be fucking broke. Everyone did. Yeah. <laughs> it's hard to keep going. Yeah. It's gonna be weird. Like every time I would come back to Japan, whether if K was here or not, I'd be like, oh, first thing I'm gonna do. Go to B Cafe with Steven. And like, that's like, that's like, it's a historical landmark right there. Yeah, that shit is true, like, bro. that's so legendary. Like, though it's not legendary for anyone else, like, that's gonna be like in our heads, like, forever. Yeah, 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 20 years from now, yeah, there was this place I used to go to. Yeah, dude, yeah. it'd be like called B was, Cafe. And that shit yeah. was legendary. You don't even know. That's so special. Like, like, those memories you build, like, if you really think about it, like, most of the time, like, let's say you're eating a really good meal, right? You're in your head, like, damn, this is really good. But instead of like, really enjoying it, right? So like most of the time you're in your head, but you can't really remember like what the fuck you did like for like most yeah. of your life. So like these type of memories, like oh yeah, like we can't. 
cafe was the shit like because mm. that's when we were like literally just living like we in the thinking. moment we were in thinking yeah we were just, there. just having fun yeah bro. we were in the moment just in this like little box like yeah. fucking drinking with red walls and shit that was fun yeah, yeah man, the show's so good. many memories there slept on that couch too many times <laughs> yeah dude <laughs> yeah. yeah there's more places to see though yeah, yeah so yeah. much more yeah man dude that's it's gonna be it's gonna be exciting starting a new adventure yeah you guys have a reason to come to New York hell yeah yeah have you been no you never been to New York? You asked me yesterday. Fuck, bro. <laughs> I'm sorry, bro. I was really drunk yesterday. Damn, how much? How do you forget so much? I don't know, what bro. That's what, yeah, I wasn't this bad before, but... Okay, so... Yeah, that's kind of embarrassing, but like I go on dates, and like if I drink too much, uh -huh. and then next day I'm asking them the same questions, they're just like, didn't you listen to me? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> fuck, I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> like, you did listen, but... Yeah, I just... I just I, you're too beautiful, I couldn't pay attention. Yeah. <laughs> I'm always not. Um, I'm, I'm losing my brain, bro. Dude, but New York is gonna fit like your style, I think. There's like a bunch of like dive bars and stuff. Yeah, like New York is Tokyo, but dirtier. Dominicans. That's what I said yesterday. They got Dominicans. Yeah, hello yeah, Dominicans. They got bagels and schmear. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's what they call cream cheese. Schmear. Schmear. Fucking gross. Schmear. Schmear. And they load it up. Yeah, dude, they grab a fucking like. Yeah. Like wall yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, a wallop. Yeah, a wallop of schmear. <laughs> A wall of schmear. I'm going to be going to like the delis and shit. Yeah. Bro, that's, that's mm -hmm. nice. Bro. Uh, yeah. For sure. Hi guys. Okay. You okay. Uh -huh. Let's just look at each other and act, look surprised. Yeah, yeah, arms down, arms down. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Hello. All right, okay, how about this? Like, be like straight, but like look to the side, like look at me. Yokohama station right now. I'm about to go home. Said goodbye to Steven and said goodbye to Sora. We're taking a thumbnail. We're just like looking at each other weird. I heard these ladies behind me talking shit. They're like, what are they recording? They're not even saying anything. But they don't know that we're taking a thumbnail. That's why you don't judge a book by its cover. You don't know what people are doing. finish these in like two seconds so last one I had a good time in Yokohama you know it's good seeing Sora again now I gotta film the last segment of the last video it's kind of funny how I vlog a new vlog before finishing the previous vlog a whole lot of calculations going on in my brain anyway today was nice especially today like I mean no offense ladies but when it's just bro talk those are good vibes yeah it just days like this it really inspires me for the future Sorry I have my airpods in. I feel like it's kind of disrespectful to be talking with my airpods on. It's like, it's kind of disingenuous, you know? Yeah, days like this, it, it puts things into perspective of how far we've come, how much we've changed. Yeah, really, I'm just excited. I'm, yeah, I'm just really inspired right now. Yeah, I got a whole lot of content coming. A whole lot of shitty content for you guys. A whole lot of juicy videos. Yeah. You heard my stomach. A whole lot of spicy content coming your way. Let me know if you like the montages and stuff. I'm trying to like envision my vlogs more. Instead of just like run and gun, film whatever and then see how it turns out. I'm trying to plan it out more now. Make it a little more organized. A little more clean. Just for you. So yeah. I remember there was a point where I was thinking of stop stopping the vlogs. But then moments like this happen and I'm like... This is why I gotta keep vlogging, because my vlogs are the realest on YouTube. Uh, you know, I don't care if I'm not the most entertaining, I'm not the funniest, I'm not the most handsome. 
but I got the realest. I got the realest. That's a fact. I don't know any other YouTuber that just documents his whole life like this. I'm not the smartest, but I'm the realest. I'll show everything. The awkwardness, the juiciness, the spiciness, the sauciness, the boringness. I'm just showing life. My life in action. And I hope y'all can relate. I hope y'all can find some comfort in my videos. You know, other YouTubers might be jumping off airplanes, doing all these crazy things. You know, and it's really interesting, you know? It's fun to watch. I guess that's why you watch it, because you're not doing it yourself, so you watch what you can't do. But I hope you can watch my videos and just realize that you're not the only one. We're all in this together. You know, if you feel like your life is boring, your life sucks, or even if you're having a good time, I hope you can watch my videos and just see yourself in it. So, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to like and subscribe and click the little ding dong to know when I upload. And I like cabbages. I'm feeling it. I'm, I'm feeling it. I'm getting back into it. I'm getting back into this shit. I was not into the shit for for a minute. I'm starting to find my spice. I'm starting to feel the spice. <laughs>